Hey everyone, it's Pastor Paul Krampitz from Bethany Lutheran Church with today's edition of From the Pastor's Study. So what I'm uh, doing is uh, being inspired by the various artifacts, uh, bits of memorabilia, uh, etc. that uh, I find here in my study at Bethany Lutheran Church. And today's uh, devotion uh, is based on this. This is a gavel. I think we're all familiar with what a gavel is and how it's used. Uh, Perhaps uh, you've seen courtroom scenes where a gavel is used by the judge to call a courtroom back to order when it becomes uh, a bit unruly, when people are disrupting the proceedings. Uh, Here at Bethany, we we actually use this gavel to call to order uh, meetings of the uh, congregation. So order is important for us, isn't it? The opposite of order is chaos. It sure feels like we are going through some chaotic times right now. Did you know that the very beginning of the Bible mentions chaos? In the first account of creation in Genesis chapter 1, in verse 2, we are told that the Spirit of God hovers, broods, or moves, depending on the translation, over the dark deep, formless void that is earth. The Hebrew word to describe this chaos is tohu abohu. It is the absence of order. It is formlessness. It is a void. Um, It is anything but orderly. And so the very first creative act of God is to be present, to abide with this chaos, and to bring into that chaos order. Boy, we sure need that Spirit of God present with us now to bring a sense of order and normalcy into our lives, both individually, as families, as a nation, and indeed as a world. There is chaos all around us. As people panic, uh, as they hoard things like toilet tissue, Um, as they act in ways that really don't make a lot of sense. So we pray that the Spirit of God would be present with us and to restore a sense of order into our world. But chaos can also be present not only around us, but within us. We might find ourselves emotionally or spiritually in a state of chaos. We might feel ourselves as though we are in a dark and deep void. And so I pray that each and every one of you would know the gift of God's presence with you, and that by the Holy Spirit's power, you would be restored to a sense of order, and that you would know the gift of shalom, peace, abundant and joyful life that God desires for each and every one of us and for all of creation. Peace be with you. Until next time, this is Pastor Paul Krampus. We'll see you soon.